Hello, faith leader, and welcome to Break Time. Today's proverb is 3121. When it snows, she has no fear for her household, for all of them are clothed in scarlet. Don't you just love that passage? When it snows, she has no fear. Do you know why she doesn't live in fear? Because she is prepared. She's prepared for the seasons of life that are ahead of her. And you know, I'm not one, this, this one speaks to me because oftentimes I'm a procrastinator and my husband behind the camera probably can shake his head yes to that. I know what needs to be done and I can see, I can have good foresight of what's probably coming ahead, the different seasons of life. But am I preparing myself for those different seasons? Am I preparing the household that I live in for those different seasons? Or am I waiting to the last minute in my workplace to get the job done? Now that describes probably, uh, I'm in every one of those categories, but I'm wondering from this, I, do we grow anxious if we wait in our, in, to prepare what God has shown us to prepare for? We all know that winter's coming and some of us live in the climate where it's going to actually snow. Are we preparing for that time of year? And you know, I, I, it's interesting because I can sit and I can think of all the things that I need to prepare for. You can too. But oftentimes what happens is I can even get the great schedule calendar things that, you know, put the task down on calendar, this task, this due date, this task, this is going to be done at this particular time. But am I taking the steps to prepare in my life? Those are so significant. You know, sometimes people say, well, that's just a waste of time to buy one of those little calendars and organizers, try to organize your life. And I want to say it is it is so significant to take a day and plan ahead, to allow your schedule not to run you, but to you for you to allow you to be with the Lord in such a way that he's dictating your schedule, your seasons of life, instead of it all of a sudden being there and you're so unprepared. And what happens when we're unprepared? We grow anxious. We can have anxiety in our heart. But this, this passage said she had no fear for that season because you know why? She was prepared for that season. And so the only thing that she feared was fear of the Lord. Now, remember, we're talking about the ideal perfect woman. None of us are there. But these words are in sources of encouragement to help us to attain this place in our life where we don't have to be anxious anymore. Because you know why? We've spent that time fearing God in such a way that we're allowing him to prepare us for the steps ahead. Have a good day.